and welcome to an episode of the Fano Frontier Draws. I'm Sheila. This is my adorable dog, Mocha. Say hi, Mocha. Mocha, what's that? Okay, Mocha's... I shouldn't have done that. But today is going to be very special because I'm going to be drawing the cheetah. And that is special because it is actually the first animal that I have ever drawn that I still have record of. I might have drawn something else earlier, but this is the earliest recorded drawing that I own, and it is of a cheetah. Brace yourself for this ingenious piece of art. Bam! I just want to point out, that's the head. Note the pointy ears. So, you know, we got that streamlined shape, perfect for running. Got some, uh, that's the tail, got the spots there. And it's really funny because I remembered a little bit of how I felt when I drew this and I was really super technical and I went to Bob Hope Primary in Okinawa. Uh, and I did this on kindergarten for my mom and she kept it. Aww. So today I'm going to draw another cheetah. I think I might have improved on my techniques slightly in the last 22 years. So let's see how I do. All right, so let's start out. I don't really want to reinvent the wheel here. I think I just want to make some improvements to my original design, you know, just, just update it a little. So let's go ahead and get started on the sketch. All right, so as you can see, the pose is basically the same so far, which is what I was going for. We've got the lower legs kind of downish, the upper legs getting ready to speed forward. Now I just need to add the head. Alright, so I'm gonna just draw the head over on the side because I'm pretty good about drawing the head the wrong size the first time around. So cheetah's heads are kind of boxy, which makes things easier for me. For some reason it's just easier to think in terms of angles than in terms of round things. See what I mean? I can't even think of what I'm trying to say. Big nose. Very big nose. Terrible face proportions right now. I hate it. It looks hilarious. Can't do this. No. Negative. Alright, so let's work a little with the patterns. Oh, and before I forget, original drawing had two ears, so we're going to keep that. Bam. Two ears. So 
So the original drawing was all one color. which is probably a slight misinterpretation. So we're gonna kind of correct that right now. That line has been bugging me for a little while. Get out here, line. So I started rasterizing the artwork before I started drawing the lines because I'm tired of the whole snap to grid, snap to point function telling me what to do. So now I have a little less of that going on. This, I drew this a lot bigger than I realized. Too much detail. Changed my mind. If you're wondering, yes, I am a little more congested than the last time I recorded for this video. I have allergies. A lot. Rats. How about blue today? How about lighter blue today?
And there we go. I think that's a slight improvement, if I say so myself. We've got, uh, you know, the same sleek, elongated body type present in my original masterpiece. Same spot shape, for the most part. And this is the cheetah. I'm really happy with how this turned out. Both times, actually. So, thank you so much. Tune in next time. If you want to support me on Patreon and help me to keep having time to do these drawings, I would love that. There's a link in the description. And if you want, just subscribe and like if you want to just keep uh, keep supporting me in a different way. Thank you so much for all your eyes' attention and all your support and all of your animal lovingness. I will talk to you next time.